explain you most easiest method which is called Newton Raphson method. Very important for uh, competitive exam. If you are adding any competitive exam, please uh, uh, watch my previous uh, video on order of convergence. And uh, this is of course very important in every exam. If you are adding gate or net or, or gate for engineering, whatever, it will come definitely. So uh, what is the addition formula for this? Uh, let we have to solve fx is equal to 0 then and n, n plus 1 f iteration is given by xn plus 1 is equal to xn minus f of xn upon f dash xn. This is very easy. With x naught. x naught either they will give or you have to support. But for you always they will give. Initial root x naught they will give you. Now we have to calculate x1, x2, x3, x4 and so on. The n plus 1 is iteration given. So what is your work? Whatever fx given in place of x put xn. Then differentiate fx and find out f dash x and put f dash xn there. So you will get one relation between xn plus 1 and xn. Some xn plus 1 you get some function of xn. Now put n value 0, 1, 2, 3. When put n value 0, we get x, a function in terms of x0. And here x1. x0 value given. So just put that value and you will calculate x1. Once you know x1, put n value 1. You, because x1 you know, so you will get x2. And series of iterations you can get. When we stop, uh, once value gets repeated, you will stop. Uh, I will take one portion. See, suppose uh, we want to solve x2 minus 3x minus 5 is equal to 0. And, uh, starting root uh, f taken what is f0 negative f1 negative f2 negative f3 positive so 2 and 3 so uh, we have taken root suppose x0 we have taken 2 so now uh, uh, we have to solve this one by newton raphson method what is your fx? x cube minus 3x minus 5. What is f dash x? 3x square minus 3. So what is xn plus 1? Is xn minus f of xn mean xn cube minus 3xn minus 5 upon 3xn square minus 3. Just simplify 3xn cube minus 3xn minus xn cube plus 3xn plus 5 upon 3xn square minus 3 uh, minus 3xn plus 3xn cancel so 2xn cube plus 5 upon 3xn square minus 3 this is xn plus 1 What is the for n is equal to 0? What we get? x1. x1 is 2x0 cube plus 5 upon 3x0 square minus 3. Uh, x0 given 2. So put value here. So 2 into 8 plus 5 upon 3 into 4 minus 3. So Two point three. 
x1 will be what? Then go for n is equal to 1. So what is x2? 2x1 cube plus 5 upon 3x1 square minus c. Just put x1 value, you will get x2 and then you proceed. But this is the way how we solve. But during the competitive exam, they will ask you calculate the value after one iteration or calculate the value of after two iteration and we have to save time. So what we do, uh, if directly they will ask uh, calculate the value after one iteration. One iteration means n is for n is equal to 0 they ask. What is x1? x1 is x0 minus f of x0 upon f dash x0. So directly you can calculate fx given to so x0 given 2. So it is 2 minus f of x0. So 2 value 8 minus 11 minus 3 f dash x0. So 2 square 4 for the term at 9. So this is a 21 by 9. So directly you can double. Uh, uh, now if they ask f dash uh, x2 value. So what is x2? x2 is x1 minus f of x1 upon f dash x1. Just put and you will get the value. So this is the method to do directly. Uh, don't uh, find the relation between xn plus 1 and xn and then you calculate. it. So uh, directly you can do it. So uh, thank you uh, for watching and now. Uh, please like and subscribe and uh, in next I will upload about fixed point iteration method. Thank you.